Ready? Hey, hey guys. guys. <laughs> oh. so we oh. hope you having a great. <laughs> Sorry, we messed this up. Okay, ready? Okay. Three, two, one. Want to do it together? Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one. Hey, hey guys. guys. Hope, Hope you're having, having a great, great day, day today. today. We are. In sunny Florida. Sunny Florida. Super, super amazing. So mm -hmm. we've had a weird. What do you think? Okay, just real quick. Yeah. What's quick. your first initial impressions? Oh, beautiful. Like, oh my goodness. Gorgeous. Love it. Much quieter than I expected. Mm -hmm. I think Greg painted a really. <laughs> I think he purposely was like, honey, the traffic's really bad. You're going to have to practice driving with me. He's like, setting me up for like complete craziness. It's really not bad. Very it's just, chill. It's just a lot bigger. So I didn't, you know, I didn't want it's you to not, be disappointed that it was bigger. You well, it's know? bigger than Zirconi. Zirconi is like tiny. Three, yeah. How uh, I many? What do you say? 3,000? Yeah, it's maybe so 34,000 people. It's so Here, tiny. there's 50,000. That's a big difference. But it's still, we're still like country, I mm -hmm. feel like, mm -hmm. for our this area yeah. so I love it I absolutely love it we've had a good week that's why I thought I filmed today we're actually it's nighttime we're going out tonight to go see our house for the first time yay super excited well, we've been driving by of course you know people are oh, probably yeah. like is that car Stalkers. drive by <laughs> but we're gonna go actually go in it today we're gonna go measure we're gonna go buy we have to get a refrigerator and a washer and dryer mm -hmm. and so we're gonna go do that tonight so I thought you know I haven't filmed like I filmed on the weekend for you guys but like Monday Tuesday didn't do anything Mm -mm. Later, I did Monday, I just chill, went to the game room, went to the pool. Tuesday, today is today Tuesday, right? Yeah. I think it is. We just laid in bed all day. I We're still in that, like, crazy. I don't think I've ever laid in bed a day if I wasn't sick. I know. So today was the day I just yeah. laid in bed all day. all day. All day. All day. I didn't even get up. Usually I'm like, let me get up. I got up this, no, I got up this morning. I was up early. I got everything done, I like laundry mm -hmm. and had coffee. Got, like, stuff I need to get done. Then yeah, I but for, bed. like, a, normal people, yeah, we're in bed all day. Yeah, all day. All day it was so great. Oh, so look at boats. Turn, turn it around and show them where we're sitting here. Okay. We're sitting at a boat dock right now. The apartment's really loud with all the kids. Mm. There's no place to disappear. Yeah, so there's nowhere quiet. There's group. nowhere. So I thought we'd do a little chit chat of how wonderful it's been in a one bedroom apartment for a week. So I thought, let oh me get your goodness. let me That's get awesome. your sense on how it's it's. Uh, how do you think it's been going? I think it's been going really good. A dude just pulled in on one of them three wheel uh, motorcycles. I love them things. What are they? Slingshots or something I like that? I don't even know. Yeah. Just out and enjoying, the, enjoying the heat from the summer. So. so, what do you think? I think it's been cool because I've been away for so long at work and stuff, you know, just to interact with everybody again and be all, you know, good and that kind of thing. So, it's been awesome for me, even though it's been trying. It's like every time I turn around, it's like, is the bathroom not open yet? Is the bathroom oh not open? Oh, my goodness. As soon as you see a door, I'm like, the bathroom's open, babe, run. Because mm -hmm. there's only one bathroom. But we're, we're doing not bad. No, we're, we're making it. We're doing we're really good. It's it. much better than like staying in on. Oh. We have some. That just get right in and get right out. Oh, and they're awesome. The other ones, everybody's like, get out! It's been an hour! Some know the seven minute rule and do yeah. well. The other ones have zero concept mm -hmm. of like quick shower. And like yeah. at all, I'm like, do you guys know but fast? We have to mm -hmm. go. Just shower your hair and get out. Like, yep. Let the soap wash your body as it rinses. And that you. must be a thing, man, because like I'm the same way. I love my poof and scrubbing down and no. you know the hot water on the muscles. Bro, I'm like seven minutes in and out, even though I don't have to hurry. Yeah, me and some of the kids were treating it like a dang sauna. Yeah, in there. yeah. Don't be treating <laughs> like a sauna when you got a bunch of eight of us to try to get a shower in a night's time. So, mm -hmm. but we're doing it. It's not bad. They're just not used to that. They're used to having their 18 baths. And they're going. I'm like, oh, another week. We we're staying here a week. We've been here a week. Will have be here exactly for a week in the apartment, mm -hmm. so it's gone awesome. Like oh during yeah, for sure. Early, like I've been getting up early and like doing like the laundry and cleaning up and doing that kind of stuff, and then um, uh, what else? And then taking Maxine out, she's loving it. She's been going out and mm -hmm. doing a little doggy walk and actually doing really good. She's Shopping. smart dog. She, she immediately pooped inside, yeah. so I'm thankful for that. She I'm knows like, she knows what direction to go out of the elevator yeah. already. And she does really good. She sees the dog. She's like, Rrr, like wants to eat them, mm -hmm. but the pop the little dogs, not the big one. She doesn't attack too much, so she's doing fairly well. But I know she's ready for like house oh yeah <laughs> soon if she like, everybody is look yeah. everybody is so we do get and then um Greg's we have like work. our inflated bed yeah we've inflated, everybody's got inflatables mm -hmm. i heard everybody blowing them all up but we're doing like and that's about and that's about it uh oh someone's pulling up right next to you like, i'm filming people there we go okay <laughs> we're filming and then um when greg's at work the kids and i go we've been just like letting them sleep in do their things i knew they were tired the last couple days and then we go there's an awesome game room so i'm gonna show you a clip right here this is where the kids and i have been hanging out during the day the internet is phenomenal girl kids are playing air hockey or no pool we were playing air hockey over here this is way fun and then uh look at this this is a fun like this is just nice look at this it's like connect four but like fancy and then Jensen's in here. This is the sport simulator. So this is cool. So we just had basketball up. You just set it over here on the computer, get out your thing, and you like hit it against this. So look at this. You can literally just shoot now. That's so cool. 
Did it go in? No. That is like the coolest thing ever. Did it make it? Okay, cool. Oh, look at it, like turns and everything. That is so neat. Virtual game, and these guys are doing, I look at them over there doing really good. They, they think they need a game table in our house, they said. That's like their favorite. That's awesome. And I was able to sit here and do some uploading, which was awesome. It's <laughs> Let's see. Ooh. Almost. They're doing a giant scrabble board. Got like a full kitchen over here. These kids are getting some hot cocoa, you know, on a hot summer day. We're finishing up Steven's plan. Maddie's chilling. And we're going to go head out to the pool and go swimming. Nice little area out here. We can sit out here if we want in the shade. There's the pool. We're gonna go to the pool over there. Lots of fun outside areas here. Great little place. And then we're right up there on the top. It's awesome. It's amazing. Like mm -hmm. yesterday, I literally just sat. Greg's like, you're not even in the sun. I'm like, I'm sitting between two palm trees right now in the shade. I'm good. And not even complaining. Mm -hmm. Like I love sun, love to sit in it. I like think I should be over there in that sun, but I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna live here the rest of my life. That's right. So I'm like, I can sit in the shade and just enjoy. Yeah. And it's not hot. I don't feel like it's mm -hmm. hot. I mean, it's warm. It, well, I think the but first it's not dying. The, the first three days we got here, the humidity was high. It was pretty high. And, I was and like, now the humidity levels stay. come way down, and it's just like perfect. Yeah. So even though it's 90, 95, it, like you're being out, it's, it's there's like a nice breeze. Mm -hmm. So there's a breeze, constant, yeah, constant breeze. off the Gulf of Mexico. So constant when you're in the breeze. shade, it's like not that. It's really not bad. Yeah, like, no. I'm really surprised. Like I thought for sure, it's gonna be really hot, but it's yeah. not that. I remember when I was coming home and telling all the kids, and they're like, it's gonna be so hot there i'm like no it really isn't yeah it's really not that bad it's different than north carolina like yeah. north carolina, it's like hot we're here it's like mm -hmm. it's and then the air conditioning works so well because it's so dry i'm like freezing oh, yeah. i'm like <clears throat> shut the air off it's so cold and, we've, and we have had plenty of days in north carolina in the summer oh, yeah where because it rains so much where it's rain and the sun comes out and you literally feel like you're walking in rain. Oh yeah, because it's just so wet. Yeah, so it's we're no we're we're not strangers to humidity. No. You know, we lived in Michigan. Michigan's one of the humidest places on yeah, earth. Yeah, I agree. So so it's been it's been good. We mm -hmm. food easy. We've been having extra breakfast. Other kids have been making. I haven't even really done anything food wise. Yeah, Brooklyn's really. Brooklyn's making breakfast like park. every day. We're like, so you want to make one? I made bacon the one day, and then um, I think I filmed that day, and then. What did we have? We had rice the rice dish that nasi goreng for app for two days, and we what else do we have with that? Um, tacos. We had tacos for two days, and then today I'm like, okay, we made hot dogs. No, yep. Culvers a few times. <laughs> Culvers multiple times. We love Culvers. We find Culvers a lot, so it's yep. it's like good. Mm -hmm. like I'm feeling not too crazy. So today is our. Um, it's actually Tuesday, but I'm filming this for Wednesday. Mm. So tonight we're gonna go to the house, like in a few minutes. I won't film it because people are still there, I think, and mm. then um, get to see it for the first time. So I'm excited. Me see too. what we gotta get, and then um, we're gonna go to Lowe's. We gotta buy washer, dryer, refrigerator, and trash cans. I bought my trash cans, but I called them. They said they need 32 gallon. I'm like, oh, I have the 45. That's okay. But the greatest thing is they have two day trash pickup. Oh my goodness. So I was like, I'm like, you guys come two days, like oh. during the week, like no matter what. And she's like, no matter what. I'm like, yes. <laughs> no matter what. <laughs> because we have trash. And Miss Amy's like, both sides of the street. I know. It's like if I just put it out one day, can you keep going? Yeah, so that was good. And then what else? We got everything set up today. We got our internet set up. The internet is amazing. For me, the internet blows out of the water, even at the apartment. I uploaded a video yesterday. Oh, yeah, 14. I was like, you said it yeah, I was like expecting because it's like shared community or whatever. And I was expecting like long. It was like 15 minutes. I don't mm. think I've ever done church had they had good internet but that was it like so yeah like a miracle in itself like even in the apartment i was using my husband and my phone it took all night mm. to upload a video so yeah i'm excited so we we ordered the fastest internet i could find yeah 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 because <laughs> right yeah right now we're just wi-fi in it yeah wi-fi everybody, i never bothered, everybody's phones i never bothered with furniture out. or internet connections or no. like any of that jazz you know just running off my phone just or whatever. temporary or whatever mm -hmm. so yeah so it's so we're excited so all that set up got our utility set up so i'm ready yeah we got our Amazon list ready to order. So we gotta get the house. So we're moving in Thursday is the day we get to move in. So we'll film that day. So today's Wednesday, so it'll be tomorrow. But we'll uh, tomorrow I'm gonna film a little bit in today's video, packing up the apartment, getting That's everything so together. Exciting. And then Thursday we'll get up and sign the papers and go. <laughs> Super. Finally. So all this resting is gonna be worth it because we're gonna oh, yeah. be back to coffee every day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Energy drink. No sleep. No sleep, but we'll get it in for the weekend. It's gonna be good. So yeah. All right. And as far as moving goes, because I say like moving is one of the most stressful things. The move? Yeah, it hasn't been ours. It hasn't been terrible for us. The move hasn't been stressful. Mm -hmm. The the details 
Yeah. Have been stressed. We've had a couple issues. I don't know. We'll talk about it yeah, later yeah. probably. We've had a couple mm -hmm. issues with the house that came up unexpectedly and nothing bad on our part. Yeah. But just undisclosed information that was, you know, presented at the end. So that caused a little bit of craziness. A little friction. A little friction. But like, you know what? I'm like, oh well. It, it worked out. It worked out great. Mm -hmm. But it was just that was more of the and then like we didn't know what day we were gonna close for sure. And so we were supposed to for sure. And so anyways, it all worked out. We closed on the same day we expected. But it was just a lot of like what if. So I'm like get my utilities do i get right. my refrigerator am i going to be able to get it delivered all these things yeah so, put things up in the air yes but it, it, in the end it works out perfectly mm -hmm. and we oh, did and we did it it was good it was got here and good i think somebody asked me how much in comparison for paying a moving company i think we paid what a couple we're having it we we got our moving trucks u-haul was the cheapest mm -hmm. by far, yeah. over penske for sure mm -hmm. and they will charge you like i think it's 40 a day so we have um the apartment complex is gated so we just got a padlock and we asked them and they said, I said, we're only here a week, is that okay? So we were able to keep our trucks in a gated area locked up. Mm -hmm. So they're sitting there baking in the sun. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like Amy was talking about uh, packing marshmallows and stuff. I don't even so know about when that. When they come out of there, they're going to be golden brown. I didn't even think about that. I mean, I did, but I was like, really, are they that bad number of trucks? So I, I, it'll be a surprise when we get the food out of there. We'll see. But yeah, so that's where our trucks are. So it's only like 40 a day. The time, they said we could store them, mm -hmm. but unloading all that, no way. Yeah, fortunately, we had a place to. Yeah, so it's like we just pulled it in the gated community and left it there. So mm -hmm. we've had the two here. And, yeah, uh, we got permission first. And yeah, yeah. With it. And it's cheaper. That was way cheaper than we called the moving company, and that was ridiculous. That was going to be like $6,500 just for 100 boxes without them even, yeah, without mm -hmm. really everything. That was all the big stuff in the Yeah, that like, was just a spitball quote because you know, yeah, they have to send somebody out and they evaluate and all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, so that was a little crazy. So I'm sure it would have been more upward, probably eight to ten, you know. Oh, eight to ten yeah, for sure for, for sure. all the boxes by the time we were done. So a lot of stuff. So it was way cheaper and mm -hmm. it wasn't bad. No. So a couple, I think a couple thousand, I think, are you yeah, all? I yeah, think it was a couple, couple thousand million. by the time we we're done, maybe 25 by mm -hmm. the time we're all done, but not way cheaper definitely way cheaper to move all of us so yep. it's good so we're excited oh yeah what else anything else anything else anybody ask i think that's it it's been good it's been great it's been i'll great. be i'll be, I'll be it'll be more great when we're all settled and everything is cool yeah like our house closed there and that's done and mm -hmm. talking to the lady um that's there getting anything she needs help with and stuff so now yeah. we'll be ready to move in here it's gonna it's be good Come, tomorrow tomorrow for you guys a couple more days for us so. uh, after we're done moving that first truck i'm just gonna i'm gonna go sit in my pool and do I'm, nothing i'm gonna i'm gonna open the front door okay i'm gonna open the back door okay. and i'm just gonna sprint through the house and jump dive the into the pool i'm excited i know jump up and click my heels together and fart <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Could you be like, where's mom at? Welcome to the neighborhood. She's in the pool. <laughs> She's just sitting there. And our neighborhood's nice. It's quiet. Yeah, it's real it's chill. It's a very chill neighborhood. It's super chill. Again, very, like you guys were warning out. You'd be surprised in the neighborhood. Already what I see, it's very chill and mm -hmm. quiet compared to a lot of other busier ones here. So this is, it's like, it's like country kind yeah, of yeah. like country mm -hmm, i feel like mm -hmm. in the but the neighborhood's like in a neighborhood well, everybody was everybody's telling me oh you want to be in this neighborhood this is like the bougie neighborhood this is the one everybody wants to be in blah 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 so the first i think two houses i looked at were in that neighborhood yeah. and to me it just felt like a circus it was just busy it's saturday just everyone everywhere yeah you know like it had the it had the amenities and it had all that kind of stuff yeah, even though that club, house that pool. house had a pool in, in yeah. the backyard as well I love the house. but it was just like just constant cars Easy. everywhere and then when I when I drove by the HO like the clubhouse and all that stuff to see it literally looked like a community pool yeah so many people there were so many people and it, it was literally like like droves of kids and parents like walking down the sidewalk to go to it yeah which I mean it it's a vibe in itself. It was. That's what we you went know, back it, and forth it's, with. It's, it's like, a, yeah, it's a cool vibe, but like, like super, blah, 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 everything yeah. everywhere, but I'm not really that guy. Yeah, so that was the, the debate, was there was a house that was really nice. It was mm -hmm. we called the mansion. Beautiful house. Beautiful, oh, yeah. but it had no pool, but it had the community mm -hmm. versus the house we have now that has a pool, but it's quieter and the house isn't. The doesn't house, ha yeah, it doesn't have any, as many amenities yeah. in the neighborhood. It's a great house, but no. it's not it's not the mansion, but mm -hmm. it's still a great much bigger it's upgrade from our house for sure it was so, the one that suited us and it did that's like what we it was wanted more. we wanted the bigger pool you know versus like a, a a bigger home that was all brand new and modern but right. it had a you know a Small eight pool. foot wide pool and right. that's really that's really popular here yeah where you know the yards are smaller so like the pools they just don't go big i mean yeah. obviously they're 100 200 dollars to get huge oh, pools pool for sure you know so most of them like I could almost jump to over, yeah. you know, as far as like the width of them goes. Yeah. 
So, I mean, we chose the bigger pool and the bigger rooms that's what versus the, the huge, huge house, house and the fancy, you know, like brand yeah. new everything Have a theater room, but there's a theater room, but I don't know yeah. if I use it for theater room, but like having a theater room and like having all those. Like a dedicated thousand square foot. Yeah, room. having all that. We were like, really, what do we want to do? It's like, what's most important? We were like, we could get the man, call the mm -hmm. mansion, it's just a big house. Yeah. But we could get the mansion versus the other, which is still big. It was nice, yeah. But it was just like, what are we going to do? We're going to have to be time in our room and then we're going to be together doing things. Mm -hmm. and outside and we're going to be doing go one place. So we yeah. skipped. We opted out. We do. There is a theater room in our house, though, but I just mm -hmm. don't know what we're using in that room. The kids are like, can we put an Xbox? Can we do. It? I'm like, yeah, I don't they know. want to turn it into their personal game room. I don't know what Steven, we're doing. Steven now is, he loves pool. I taught him how to play pool. Yeah, they the, saw the, at the apartment. So now he's he all, he's pool. all about. We gotta get a pool table. Yeah. Up there. So we're gonna see. I don't know what we're gonna do up there. It's an extra room. There's two extra rooms upstairs. Just not sure. One's gonna be an office for sure. I just don't know what we're gonna do with the other one. Still in the air. And kids are like, we want our own room. So they're all. I'm like, no. You guys are sharing two kids to a room. <laughs> They're like, that's not fair. I'm like, you're going to be out working and going to school. And you're barely going to be home. I'm not yep. going to waste a bedroom. <laughs> I know. They're up to 18. It's getting so crazy. So it's all good. So they're going to, it's going to be good. So we're, yeah, it's going to be exciting. So yeah. we're good. So that, that's what we chose today, but just small, quiet. Just like it. That's really mm -hmm. nice. I like, do we have to go? Because it's, how far is it from here? Yeah, we probably should. So we're going to go. We'll be back in just a minute after we see the house for the first time. All right. Super exciting. Oh. Here we are walking in our neighborhood. Listen how quiet it is. Our new neighborhood. What like, time are we at? Eight o'clock. We're at eight. Yeah, quarter to nine. No, they weren't in the house. Mm -mm. I was gonna film in the house, but I was like, "Hey, the lighting's like dark." But yep. <laughs> it's nice. It's nice. My first initial, I was like, "Okay." The living room is too the, small. The living room's a little <laughs> small, but I had to like. I knew it was gonna be, but then after mm -hmm. I walked in and saw the rooms upstairs, I'm like, "It's much bigger than expected upstairs." Yeah, because I was telling you, I was telling her the whole time, like, you can't trust the pictures you see on the internet. Because they look they huge. Stretch them way out. Yeah. So after seeing upstairs and the way the layout is upstairs, I'm like, wow, it's much bigger upstairs than I mm -hmm. thought. And then walked outside to the, the rooms pool. rooms are big, right? Rooms are huge. The pool. Oh my goodness. I wanted to jump in the pool. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, can I just go in right now? So nice. So yeah. And the kitchen. I like, I love the kitchen. I love the kitchen. Yeah. I think the first time I was here, it was even later. It got, yeah. it got to be around nine o'clock, I think. And, uh, you know, you can light the pool up and see it yeah you know like all purple or blue or yeah, whatever yeah that's valid and then that. he turned the waterfalls on and then hit the jets i was like dang it's nice so even our realtor said that it's a big pool for florida and it is, deep, one huge. of the deepest so it's six feet at the side so yeah, I, I think it's the seven. guy that lived there told me it was seven and a half feet when yeah. i got to talk to him so that's a deep pool so seven I, and a half feet I like it. I do. Mm. I can't wait. I'm good. I know. You're like, well, the living room freaked me out for two seconds. I'm like, because you know why? I got that big giant couch. But then I had to think, I can arrange that couch any way I want. Hmm. And that's what we'll do. Okay. Because the one side's not as. And you can even get rid of that. We need that couch. 15 passenger couch. That's the only couch we have. We only have one living room. There is a room upstairs that we'll, I don't know what we're going to do with it. It was mm -hmm. like a theater room. But I don't know what we'll do with that room. It's yet. weird. It's almost like a fifth bedroom. So but it's, it's not, not yeah. like huge, huge. But, but it's pretty big. Yeah, it's, it's like big open. So I don't know. Uh, like a pool table. A pool table would fit in there, there Stephen. Mm -hmm. Maybe. We'll see maybe. how it is. So we'll see. So we're going to go. Uh, this is nice. It's like walking outside. It's so nice. Mm -hmm. So we're going to go ahead to. Uh, Lowe's and go pick out our appliances, but I like it a lot. I, I like yeah, there's like, and there's fruit trees. Oh my goodness. I can't wait for my plant, hort, are they horticulturist? Mm -hmm. <laughs> to let me know because there's some fruit yeah. on some of the trees and I have no idea. It looks like a papaya, mm -hmm. but I don't really know my, I don't know that kind of fruit. Yeah. So I'm excited I, to I see bet it. you if you show it, well, can we get in there? No, everything's locked. Okay. We'll be in here. You guys will see it tomorrow. Oh my goodness, but I love it. I really it. like the neighbor's house. Like how they got the count of the cement. Yeah, we won't show the neighbor's like house. Like the extruded. Concrete there. around all the trees and that. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be good. So, love it. So, well, guys, we'll see it tomorrow. Kids are gonna be excited. Right. Meet our first neighborhood lady, Linda. Linda, super sweet. Linda, so thank you for uh, being so kind and such a sweetie. Invited me to a ladies' luncheon that the ladies do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, they do a uh, monthly ladies' month luncheon. Okay, yeah, so so Miss so Amy will be getting plugged in. I'm real like, quick. she's like, you want to get to meet people? I'm like, okay. So that's mm -hmm. like the next week. So what I the, asked if the if the guys do anything. If no. the guys do like a fishing. Something, but they don't, or you know, or maybe she does. She's like, oh, she's like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the men do. I do. Who knows? We're just doing the earth thing. But I, I like it. I like it. I had to like. At first, I was like, wait a minute. The first, just walking in, I'm like, wait a minute. But it's still like huge. The colors. I love it. I wasn't yeah. sure. I told you the living room was gonna be like with your enormal couch. Yeah, would like, be tight. We're gonna have to kind of rearrange that. It's just like your tip. standard size living room. Sure. It's just the way that our old house was. It was so long. Like that is where all the square footage of the of the house is. Yeah. In that great room. Yeah. You know, so that was nice. Yeah. 
but your kitchen was smaller. Your bedrooms sure. were t tiny compared. Exactly. You know. So I think we can just finagle the couch because you can. It's movable, so mm -hmm. you're just moving things around. But no, I like, and the rooms are huge upstairs. I was like, wow. Mm. I'm really surprised. I was picturing like there's like in between each room is like there's like two empty big rooms mm -hmm. that are like office or theater or game room, whatever it's gonna yeah. be. So and then the pool, yeah. Yeah. Sold on the pool. Yeah. Like yeah. <laughs> so nice. So yeah, I'm like good. The mm -hmm. floors are nice. I didn't. I thought they were more creamy, but they're like white. Um, what did that be? And just tile. They're t uh, they look like just stone, regular old stone, stone tile. tile. They look really nice. But so. brand new. Yeah, brand new. So it's good. Like even the tile in our bathroom. Like I thought it looked older yeah. and like not very good. And then I was just paying more attention to it. And, and I'm like, oh, I like the color of it. Okay. And the grout, like everything is brand new. Yeah. It seemed like a shame to rip all that floor up. Okay, that's good to know. I, I, didn't, really, I didn't really look at it much on the bathroom, yeah. but I was like. Yeah, the vanity and uh, the the uh, walk-in shower. Okay, you want to do with that? Yeah, I would wanna, I'd want to modernize that a little okay. bit. It, everything's new, it's yeah. just like, something that somebody older might like right so but still very nice mm -hmm. it's really nice there's four bathrooms in us so we all can use a oh my gosh they're so excited so it's gonna be nice they don't they just don't, they don't well, even know. I'm, I'm sure they can imagine the struggle <laughs> one bathroom eight people people so now four there'll be four bathrooms and we'll never I've, we've only had three before mm -hmm. right one two three and that was still like manageable but there was still like i gotta use a bathroom yeah there's many times boys would go outside just because but i'm like can't do that here mm -hmm. <laughs> So good, very good. I like it. I do. We're moving in. Yeah. It's right. your first reaction. First these, reaction. These are your people these seeing your people very seeing. first reaction. I like it. I do. I like I said. I had to like for a minute. I was like, okay, well, small. Oh, yeah. But then I'm like, but wait a minute. But it's like cozy. Mm -hmm. Like it's. I feel like it's. You know homey. she. You know she likes it because what? if she didn't like it, you wouldn't see me in the videos for like probably four days. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, this is how much I trust God. I'm not purposely coming down to, to come see, see this it. house. And I was like, I can't. And God was like, this is how much you trust that I am going to get you guys the right house. So I know you prefer the other one just based off what you love. Just, I like the modern, and modern's stainless, great. and you know, oh, like I all that too. stuff. Like, like the apartment looks. Sure. But, but not, like just none of them had the same vibe bit, as that Yeah, it didn't have family cozy vibes. And they didn't, they didn't have the huge bedrooms. No. Again, like in those, they were 3,500 square feet, but a 1,000 oh. square feet was in a game room. Right, game room. You know, so it's like how much they were like more like need? dressed to impress houses. Right. And we've never been that way, and we've never lived that, no. like in that situation. No, it's like. I'm not down with pulling in, you know, the neighbor, hey, look at my new car. Right, right, you know, right. I got a, well, I got a 1,500 square all my kids can fit two in a room. That's, That's like a miracle. right. <laughs> like our, our babies have a be, way bigger, bigger bedrooms. Yeah. You know, that was by far more important yeah, than more. the look at this giant mansion house we bought. But it's still a big house. Oh, it's, it's still huge. Big. It's still three thousand square it's feet. It's still a big house, much bigger. So. Yeah. But we got the we got the the square footage where we needed it right. versus, versus like random places yeah, or whatever. Yeah. Like even the big man. Well, the big mansion was probably a little bit more, wasn't it? Or not really. It was thirty three. Okay. So it's still a bit. But it didn't have a pool at and, all. Yeah, no pool. We'd be hanging out with a bunch of people, chilling, mm -hmm. or what they call them, doing the HOA thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so good and quiet. We just walked the neighborhood, and I'm like, it's just quiet. You could hear a pin drop in the neighborhood. It's like super quiet. So I don't know how it'll be after all my kids get there, but oh, it'll be cool. <laughs> it'll be great. No, it's gonna be nice. So I, I like it. Because mm -hmm. like we still look. back up to a, a road that's semi, mm -hmm. you know, semi busy. Yeah. yeah. So it's not like it's not like in the middle of nowhere pin drop, no. but very. Very yeah. comfortable. So very I like comfortable. it's cozy and comfortable. I That's feel like how I, look I at feel it. like it's cozy. It's gonna be very yep. like like even my garage. <clears throat> when I looked at the house, I couldn't even see the garage floor. Dude had so much stuff. Oh, in he was there. so packed. He was definitely a lot. <laughs> yeah. His wife didn't clean his garage up for him at no, all. <laughs> no, 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 no. And even like the even like the door going in and out of the garage has like dirty fingerprints yeah, yeah, on yeah. it. You know, like that kind of thing. So I couldn't even see the floor. So now with it all empty, I just realized that the floors are epoxy, epoxy painted. I wondered it didn't look like it was. So that's so good. it just they just need to be like at a you know, like floor, good floor scrubber yeah, or whatever. Scrub it up. Lows and dang. It's gonna be good. Yeah. So I'm excited. I like it. it's got a little butler's pantry. Mm -hmm. It's got nice I'm like a lot more space than I intended for kitchen stuff. That was my concern. I was like, where am I put my freezers? Where am I gonna put you know an extra refrigerator? So, so you did like, find enough room for it. There's there's multiple everything. places I can put it now. So I'm like, okay. So mm -hmm. now we're gonna go to Lowe's right now and go buy the refrigerator. The refrigerator. They did leave dryer. one, but it's just old. I don't probably get rid of it. It's in the garage. And then uh, I don't know, baby. We won't leave you for 
refrigerator we'll out see. there. I mean, yeah, we could leave a big one out there because we can always use more space. Yeah, <laughs> but, I'll clean it up. But we'll see. de louse it and everything. We'll see. What, I'm trying to do with just the one. We're in, we got the biggest Did one. Did it look dirty inside of it? Oh, yeah, looked? clean for sure. Oh, okay. The one we picked out, we came yesterday and looked at Lowe's and um, picked out a washer and dryer and a refrigerator and look at the measurements of what if they were off to look. Um, but I, we got the biggest one we could find and I think it's a nice, nice one. So mm -hmm. we're at Lowe's right here. It's like everything's right by our house. Nice little town. Five, five minutes, ten minutes to here? Probably ten minutes. Ten minutes to Aldi and Lowe's mm -hmm. and I think. And now it's funny, the lady that we just met. Yeah. She's like, there's just not that much out here. What are you talking like, about? What? There's like stuff everywhere. There's like stuff everywhere. I'm like, you don't realize what we came from. So, we had a Dollar General. <laughs> yeah, so she, must, she must have been in Sarasota. I yeah, but there's, yeah, that's what she said. Yeah, there's like literally a brand new Aldi. It's not even open yet here, right by our house. Yep, home and good. What else? Is Costco right here or is that a little bit further? Uh, Crunch Fitness, Five Below. I think. Uh, what, uh, your Costco was probably 15 minutes. Okay. Sam's Club's a little bit further away, so I'll probably be doing a Costco membership. Mm -hmm. and then for sure. Walmart. For sure. I know I've seen 10,000 Walmart, so I know they're somewhere, but all these literally right down the street, so mm -hmm. it's good. Okay, we're going to go to Lowe's. Let's go pick up some stuff. Let's do it. It's so fun. Going to Lowe's, but we're not doing a project. We're buying appliances. Yeah. That's much better. Yeah, the project's just starting about two weeks. Yeah, that's. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't I'm have. Sorry, I'm a project guy. It's That's not, just what I do. It's not going to be 750 pounds of eggs of no, cement. No, it's going to be fun stuff. Yeah, yeah. All the energy I put into that, I can remodel that. Into oh yeah, house. we got to think we got on this way. Exit, unless it opens. All right, this is what we're getting right here. Are we getting the blue one? We're getting the blue one. Thank Even, you. Well, the kit, the house has no navy in it. I like the navy too. I would let's paint. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna paint. So we navy, we're gonna, we're gonna do these two right here, but not stackable. And we were even looking at the uh, colors for the, that the HOA have for the houses. Yeah, because you have to follow the rules. <laughs> yeah, so we're looking at the beige in the navy. Yeah, in the navy, so that'll be really for good. For the house. And so. then this is gonna be our, that one, is, that's the five cubic. Mm -hmm. Yes, five cubic foot, and then we're gonna do the refrigerator. It looks like, it's not the, we looked at the Samson. I wanted to get a, I don't like Samson, that's why I did not choose Samson washer and dryer, because of all the issues in mine, but we're gonna get a Samson refrigerator. So I think this, we're going for this, this one, yeah. Right? It was the biggest yeah, this looks like the biggest feet. 30. And it's got a little water filter. Yeah, they, they show them this little feature. So you can have water. I'm, I'm like, that's going to be empty all day long. How does it come out? Okay. <laughs> yeah, so, but literally you can get a glass of water, yeah. put it in, and it auto refills. Yeah, and then it has a little ice in here. I know we have our ice machines, but it does have nugget and regular ice too. So. And then there's. Another one underneath. It's pretty good storage. Yes, yeah, so that's not bad. So they're all, they got all got savings. You know, you can save a thousand dollars if you buy one today. So. And then you'll have the one in the uh, We just got look at, yeah, let me look up measurements real quick. Okay, we had a change of plans. There was only, they were only was showing one in the area of this one. So we had chance it. I didn't want to chance it. So online we were looking at these bespoke ones, but this is a bespoke, but I didn't know because I didn't know if I'd like the white. But look at, it's got like this. And this is like the beverage center. And the water right there and then it opens right here but we were just looking them up and i'm like i can just get in stainless steel we can't get the panels right now the panels are uh whatever on back order but she said we can get these ones so we're gonna get this one right here greg's trying to get me over to his home depot <laughs> my internet's not working so i can't look he just saw this one in stainless steel but i don't know i just never got appliances there i feel like that's a bad thing so we're gonna order the white one i feel like that might but i have a stainless steel stove so i don't know if that's gonna look weird but i can always get panels later she gave us a rebate and pretty much free so I think we're just gonna go with it. He's over here having a heart attack. <laughs> Jeez. He's looking I up. I didn't realize appliances like so expensive. In the past, when Amy would say we need an appliance, I would say, oh, I, I know this great used appliance store right around the corner. <laughs> I'd be like, check it out. I just got a freaking washer for fifty bucks. Yeah, no, no more fifty dollars. I mean, we got a really nice one. It's nice. It's the same size one we got, but it's in white. So I think the white will be a little bit different, which will be really nice. Just a different look for it. So. Yeah. No, I like the white. I think the white's pretty cool. And then she said it's not magnetized, so I'm like, wait a minute, I just bought that. Oh, magnetic yeah. marker board. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that. We're gonna have to get creative. That's <laughs> get all. creative. So oh, here's some cord <laughs> This is the locks. Oh wait, is that? Yeah. So we need to. Um, Lowe's is gonna. So, but then he looked up Home Depot while we're in here, and they have the stainless steel one. I'm like, don't do that to me because I don't want to buy but a plant. Here's the cool part about that fridge is you can pop panels in and out, and you can make them whatever you want. And she gave us a warranty paper. So and they have different colors. Yeah. So in five years, if you're like, Change I don't my... like this bl blue. White. I want to make this green or it blue could. or yeah the like kitchen is blue. the kitchen is you teal can totally match the i know so i'm like don't question because it was like all the stress for a minute like which color panels do you even get so, so you got the bespoke 
from Bespoke. Samsung. That's nice. 30 cubic inches. Yeah, the, that's the biggest one you could get. The hidden water. Yeah, the hidden water, which is awesome. What, what are they call the beverage center? Yes, beverage center. So. Yeah, attention. Okay, so we're gonna get out of here close. We need to get a um a new lock. We liked our Lockley lock that we got at our old oh. house and we left it. Okay. And so um we need to get I didn't bring my tape Oh, hold on. <laughs> the uh, so we wanted to get another Lockley because um oh, we like them. Just for Greg. Oh, the tape measure right there. Mm -hmm. which, which one was it? Where's the lock? Right here, Lockley. Okay, so the throw of its way at the bottom, I would assume it'd be more up towards the center, but it's right at the bottom. Like in front of the yeah. lock? Yeah. So from here down to the top of the, you know, that And the handle? Pole, yeah, it was like two and a half inches. So that's right, two, yeah, that's it's three. Great. Is that going to be good? Amazing. That's okay, because we love yeah. this. We have a Lockley in our old house and it just was awesome. The kids are like, we need a Lockley. So we're just going to get a Lockley here. I think you have to get it up front, right? The latch edition. Oh, not the latch edition. So we found uh, the Lockley here. Greg's logging in real quick. So there's this. How much? Two thirty-nine. So it's like ten dollars. Oh, it's right and left. Look at that. Huh? So for delivery Friday, you want it before Friday or do you want it now? Dang! They, look at that. They charge you not for a left fingerprint. It's not fair. This is not. So which one do you want to do? Ten dollars or no? You want to save ten dollars? What are these? It's the same thing. Oh, those are all the Wi-Fi thingies that come with it by the doors. Remember? They beep when the door's not shut. Oh. But we never got to use them because our internet was so crappy. I was going to say, I don't think I've ever seen them, have I? Like, we we have it at the top of our door. Oh. So, do you want one here or do you want there? I did, I'd say just get it here for okay. 10 bucks. So that's right here. Have it in our hand. Okay, let's go find a trash can. Let's go. Cool. All right, we got this one right here. Okay, we're going to be hopeful here that we get to the trash can before they lock the doors and lock us we're in Walmart. Out of time. It I took don't... us like five hours to pick our stuff. Where's the trash cans, though? Oh, honey, I want that. I know. We got to get outdoor stuff. Flying down here. Where's the trash cans in Lowe's? I think they're all outside. They may be. I'm just gonna have to have a broken trash can for a while. They may just be there. Okay, never mind. That's it. All right, I guess we'll just get our Lockley. Okay, we got the Lockley. Pa pa. Pa pa. So pa, -pa. We, this is a great one. That's It'll a good be good. One. Okay, we're gonna go ahead. It's high time. I think that's it. Let's I see. didn't realize how expensive these little gifts were. Everything's so expensive, it's, but they're great, and we like, love it. So it's nice, yeah. you know, everybody's coming in, it's easy. Hmm. Okay, so we're going to go ahead home. Let's I'm going to say it. goodbye for you guys. I'll see you in the morning. I'm going to go clean. Oh, this is it. I'm going to stay, I'm, I'm going to stay on the video still, but you're not. You're going away. You're disappearing. Oh, is that right? It's dark. My, my, uh, my cameo is It's dark now. We're not going to be able to film. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. <laughs> hey, are you, still, are you over there still staying on the film? <laughs> I'm waiting for you to come back, because you can see there's light. Usually I'm we're in a dark either. place. We're in a dark I'm place. So now it'll, we're going to go back to the because everything's closed now. So now we'll be done. <sighs> Greg's going to work in the morning. I'm going to clean the apartment, get us packed up, and ready to move on out. Mm -hmm. That'll be the film tomorrow. We'll see yes, you too when you get home. Oh, yeah. Okay, so bye, Greg, but we'll see you in a minute. Okay, bye, guys. <laughs> Good morning. It is the next morning up bright and early. I have been sleeping in the last few days, which has been, I don't even have an alarm set, which is even better. It's like, just, I told you, I told you I would rest eventually. And I did, I definitely did. So today I woke up at four and I was like, oh wow. And I'm like, I don't even feel like going back to sleep. I'm like, I feel rested. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. I'm ready to go because we are now on packing up and moving out tomorrow is our move out day. So we're going to be, um, Today I thought, you know, I'd just get up early and start getting things done. So this is this is what the state of the apartment is when you have kids and you don't clean anything. It's like yesterday I did nothing. I did nothing. Did nothing. And I was like, why don't you make some mac and cheese for lunch? Why don't we make hot dogs for dinner? And we did. And it was like, they did. The kids are awesome. They did the dishes. I'm like, I came home and I said, um, after we got our stuff, and I was like, you guys don't have to do the dishes. And they did the dishes, which was really sweet. And then uh, we just have things to pick up. So I'm going to get laundry rolling. I have a pile of clean stuff. I just couldn't find the blanket because I have a blanket I put on the floor because I didn't want to put on the floor. And so I had to look for that. A child took it. So I'm going to lay that out so I can put the clean laundry on it, get another load going, clean up in here. And then we're going to start um, cleaning out the cupboards and stuff. There's not a whole lot of stuff here. Greg was here um, living, which is, you know, he had his job down here. So there's a lot of stuff that he purchased for just the apartment and things that we're not going to need because He's so funny. He's like, honey, I like he bought just some cheapy stainless steel pots and stuff from Walmart. And he's like, oh, I can use that like a pot, like a cooking pot. And he's like, yeah, I was cooking my stuff in the oven in that. I'm like, in the pot? He's like, it worked amazing. I said, I got like roasters, babe, and like really good stuff. He's like, okay, so I need to go through and see if there's anything worthwhile to keep and then the rest um, be able to pass off and we'll be able to uh, get it at a donation center. I saw a lot of Goodwill donation centers around the area. So that is our goal today. Pack up everybody's stuff again. 
refold the clothes, get them in their suitcases, everybody's stuff, make sure it's clean and good. We will have our washer and dryer comes in Friday, so it's a couple days from now, so it's okay. We'll get our laundry done today. I won't worry about having to get everything in. We can leave the stuff here, which is nice because our internet doesn't start till the next week, so we probably will come back and use the internet. We can use the washer if we need to. We'll probably come back and empty the refrigerator and freezer because ours doesn't come in until Friday. So we'll still utilize this for certain things like that and then we'll have to come back and really clean it, but I'm gonna clean as much as I can so that when we do come back, it's just a simple whatever whatever we have to do. A little bit of bleach here and there and you know, just a good deep clean of the, there's only so many supplies that I have here. So we'll, we'll do what we can today. So today is gonna be cleaning up, packing up. It's gonna be, it's a great day. I've already got up, got my cup of coffee rolling. I got my second cup of coffee going. We made cookies last night. So we got cookies over there, there's still four. I got more, I'm gonna make more of those today. I wanna look and see what I got in my refrigerator. Make a list for the store because um, we're thinking moving in. It's like there is a refrigerator in the garage. Um, so I'll get like drinks and I'll get some, I have veggies. Like, I don't know, I have to make a list of stuff. Easy snacky foods so that like, like ramen, the kids will love ramen, but I realize there's no microwave. We don't have, we don't have a microwave in the house. We have a really nice stove. We'll have a really nice refrigerator, but I don't know. It's like, can you live without a microwave? I don't know. We're going to have to see. I do have an air fryer that we could heat things up in, but we'll see. It'll be one of those things I'll have to go get after. Based on the needs, do we really need it? We're going to see. We're going to see. So, um, I don't know. I guess we can always use the Keurig, right? The Keurig has hot water. I'm just thinking out loud here. So maybe I do ramen because it's easy and the kids can make a bowl of it and be happy sandwich material i have i think i have lunch meat still i do have lunch meat still before it's only it's not old um but i could get more of that we'll see i'll think talk with the kids today figure out what we want to grab and then uh so we'll be good to move it and then once we're in we'll do a grocery haul i get the refrigerator in and then we'll go to the store and buy everything but just stuff to get us through the next few days and then there's always culvers right around the corner so you know we can always eat out and we love culvers <laughs> so it's gonna be a good day we're gonna get things packed up you guys ready for a good day all right i'm ready all right let's go a washer and dryer when we went to look for a washer and dryer i like these washer and dryers now i don't like i didn't like the front ones when um we lived in the country because i know a lot of my big family friends have front loading ones and the seal always leaks but i attribute it to like stuff getting in there rocks you know mountain pieces <laughs> sediment so i was like i really don't want one but i and i i just did not like my samson wash and dryer at all is maxine do you have to go out it's kind of early. Do we have to go out? I feel like she needs to go to the bathroom. I'm gonna take Maxine out to the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Okay, Maxine was a little fit to be tied today. My goodness, she like, she's been doing so good. Like not, I mean, she wants to eat little dogs or dogs, you know, in general, but she's like not crazy. So we got out of the apartment here and she just started barking down the hallway, which you know, it's just like magnified. There are people there. I'm, there's a lot of dogs here. Like I was, we were out by the pool last night and there was like barking and I'm like, is that Maxine? Please tell me it's not Maxine. So I had to like text Brooklyn. I'm like, is she barking? She's like, no. So there are other animals in here that, you know, they bark and they are, they bark, they bark. <laughs> I was like, even people leave them out and they just bark all day. So she, but she doesn't. So we, we just went out in the hallway and she's just like barking down the hallway. And then she was like out of control pulling to get to the elevator. And then we got outside and then there was like another lady with her dog walking. They both looked at each other, started growling. So she went one way, I went the other way. <laughs> Maxine. Then I came in. I'm like, I forgot to give her a bone when she wakes up. So she's enjoying a bone now. Should be quiet. So back to washer and dryers. So anyways, I did not like my Samsung washer and dryer. Did not like it. Did not. I probably will never buy a Samsung washer and dryer ever again. We did buy a refrigerator Samsung based on, because that's all I had, big size. But I did not like how long it took to dry the clothes. I just didn't like it. I seem like I've had the repair guy out a few times and I just bought it. So we actually had to have the repair guy come to our house. Like he came after we left the house because it had broken the day before we moved. <sighs> it's all good. Anyways, so I knew I didn't want, I wanted a Whirlpool or GE just because they're basic, they work. And so these we had picked up, this is only a 4.5 um, size one. And I, I found the 5.0 and we were just going to get that one and loved it, but they didn't have, um, any available. So that's when we chose the GE ones that we saw. And then they all only had it in white or sapphire blue. So that's why we picked out the blue one. I'm like, the blue will be nice. We're going to do some accent colors in our house because nothing's navy in the house, but very well could be. So I think we'll do, it's like the, I feel like it's the beachy vibe house because 
does everybody in Florida, not everybody decorates that way, but I feel like those are a lot of the colors or some of the colors, the vibe going on in the house. So anyways, so that was why we got our GE one, but these ones are really, really like the basic. I looked for these exact ones. They had an upgraded version, but just a little bit smaller. I wanted bigger. So I'm gonna throw laundry in. So loving these because they're done real quick. I'm like, I did towels, like a bunch of towels. And I'm like, wow, they're done already. And like, I literally did all my laundry. Was it yesterday we did laundry? No, the two couple, whatever, a couple days ago and I had so much laundry and I was done before noon. And I'm like, that would have taken me all day, all day at the mountain. So very thankful for a good washer and dryer. So I'm gonna throw in, we're just throwing everybody's clothes together because that's how it is today. Um, and then I'm just gonna put in most of their clothes, see what, see what I get more, more clothes, more towels, whatever, pitch them in, throw a load of laundry. So where do you start? Always start in the kitchen in the biggest area. So my goal will be clean this off, wipe it down, and then clear off the counters in the kitchen, get that cleaned out, and then we'll uh, go from there. Verner's, when Greg was down here, because um, we didn't, remember I couldn't find Verner's in a can, so his Publix had Verner's. So, so he bought a stash of Verner's. So we have lots of Verner's. There's Verner's everywhere here. So let's wipe everything down. I hurried up and filled a trash can because you can just put your trash outside the apartment and they pick it up. So when I took Maxine, there was a bunch of trash out there. I'm like, ooh, maybe I can hurry up and get a load out and they'll pick it up. But um, I just, so I hurried up and threw stuff from the refrigerator in there, filled it up, bathroom trash couldn't be full and then set outside and realized they just had picked up everybody. So I'll leave it out there, see if they get it. If not, we can run it to the um, trash compactor. No big deal. Maxine, she's like barking. All right, continue wiping. Greg had this kitchen mat in here, so I will um, hand wash it here and I'll just set it outside and let it dry because it's, uh, you can't put it in the washer, I don't think, so I'll just kind of scrub it here and I'll stick it outside because it'll dry on the floor to heat. I'll clean my floor in sections here. I'll just kind of take everything off this area and sweep it up. I won't wash it because, or should I wash it? No, no need to wash it. I'm just going to pick everything up and then uh, do a Swiffer over here. Okay, definitely could use a vacuum in here. Robot vacuum, exactly, <laughs> but it works. The Swiffer works, and like Greg probably just didn't have as many crumbs as we would have with all the kids, so I'm doing my best, sweeping as best I can. It works, you use what you can do. You don't always need every fancy schmancy tools out there to clean your home. It makes it easier. You just find something else to do, but you can do things just with, you know, good old water in a, a bucket, and uh, even a, a mopping agent that doesn't really work for the floor, but it, it works. So I decided to mop. <clears throat> I decided to mop it because it was all sticky by the door there. So once you start, you might as well finish. So I'll just do this whole floor. It'll take just a few seconds. I can imagine that this the swimmer thing's kind of neat. I could imagine that this bottle would be expensive because we've only been here a little bit and bought a brand new bottle, <laughs> and uh, it's definitely worn our house. 
we won't be we won't have to use it i'll be able to use my norwex mop in there because of this amount of floor space and it's all just the ceramic tile this is the peel and stick tile that we had in our house so that makes me feel good because this is a nicer apartment complex like a nicer one so i'm like wow that's the same exact peel and stick tile i used in my house so not bad okay let's finish doing it now the waiting you have to wait for a few minutes for everything to dry <laughs> so i'm like okay otherwise you get footprints and the washer is almost done that first load took less than 20 minutes that's crazy flip the laundry and put some towels in here then i just walked in the bathroom and realized there's a whole pile of dirty clothes on the floor in here so <laughs> i'll do another load after this and i gotta do the rugs so I'm going to take, I'm going to go on my side over here. This is the other side, the living space. I'm going to take, I've been hanging up my dresses and I literally hang them outside. I know on this little, there's a light fixture, so I just hang them up up there. It dries within half hour because it's so warm here. I'm gonna step outside for a minute. Like, look at this. Like, look at this morning out here. <laughs> Everything's gonna get foggy. What a gorgeous morning. My goal today is to make it down there one last time before uh, we have to pack up and move, or before we have to move. Pack it up will be done, so it's gorgeous. Definitely steamy. My camera's getting all steamy here, so. It's been awesome. This has been so good. I told the kids, I said, now remember, our, our new pool is not as big as this pool. Because <laughs> they're like, wow, this is amazing. I'm like, yeah, our pools, it's deeper, but it's not as big as this one. <laughs> so they're going to be like, why is this so small? <laughs> it's, fun. it's so nice. It's so quiet. Like this, it's barely used, which is awesome. Like there's certain couple times during the day where there's people down there, but for the most part when we're there, there's like nobody. So it's, it's very nice. So we'll see. All right, let's go back in. We're going to finish. Keep working. Okay, so I'm going to work on my corner over here. My corner. Uh, just go kind of fold my clothes. Keep up. I've been, I've been wearing like the same two dresses because it is warmer. I like these ones. I got these off of Amazon. They're long. They're nice. They're nice and cool here. I know I have a closet full of clothes, so I don't want to order any more yet. But these are definitely they were cheap. So I've been washing these and just wearing them for the last couple days because it works. So I'm going to just keep out something for tomorrow and then... Um, kind of get that so it can be closed maybe and then uh, we'll be able to take it tomorrow. So since this that part is somewhat done, I'm just gonna keep doing laundry. I'm gonna start packing stuff in here that we're not gonna need. So I do have boxes and stuff and bags. So I found a bag over there. I found my moving gloves. So I put those in my purse. And then um, I'm just gonna kind of clean out the cupboards. Best I can, keep out what we eat today. Maybe just leave it on the counter. I know it'll be messy, but at least we'll, it's okay, it'll work. And I can wipe out any cupboards that are dirty.
Okay, clean out the snack cupboard here. I had a laugh. I'm like, this whole bag was full when we moved down here last week. It's pretty much empty. So the good thing is we'll have a lot of like starter food for the new house because, you know, who knows how everything fared in the moving truck. We're just going to have to be hopeful. <laughs> so just pack this up. All right, this is my little work zone right now. <laughs> I was standing up working at the counter. I'm like, you know what, I need to sit down. So I'm sitting down on my floor with a um, cooler and my laptop. So what do I have to do still? So I have most everything put in a container, bag, or box to pack. The only thing left would be the refrigerator stuff, which I will wait for, obviously. We don't get our refrigerator until Friday, even though Thursday we can move in there. So I will just take like cold stuff that we can, there's a garage for Jitter. It's just not clean. I probably will clean it before I move in. So I'll just go get juice boxes and you know, some fresh stuff that we can eat for like a day. We can always come back here. It's not very far from the house. And so um, I will do that. And then the bath, the, what's left is the bathroom supplies and the kids stuff. So, and then I've got laundry. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna edit for a little bit. It's early, it's only nine o'clock right now. Um, I'm gonna get some editing done. And then as the kids wake up, I will um, have them bring their bags. I mean, the girls are pretty much self-sufficient. Boys are pretty good too. Actually, everybody is self-sufficient. Have them pack up their stuff, leave out an outfit for tomorrow, leave their bathing suits because they're gonna want to swim today, and then um, have them get their toiletries and stuff. And then I can clean the bathroom out a little bit um, after their stuff is out. So I'll just basically say pack everything up like we're leaving. And then I left out, um, I was gonna get rid of the pans but our new house has a big stove, like a big stove. There's uh, what, six burners, two, four, six, is there eight burners? I think there's eight burners. I don't have that many pots because I have downsized over the years and then I got rid of some bigger ones. So um, I did keep a couple smaller ones and smaller frying pans, even though they're not the best, there's cheap ones, but the kids can use those because those are good ones for kids to ruin. <laughs> so I thought, so what I did, I left out two pots here because I took out a can of beans. We can do that with hot dogs today. We're gonna have the same food we had yesterday, mac and cheese for lunch and hot dogs and chips and there's fruit and salad for dinner. It works, it's easy, they don't care. Breakfast, there's bars and there is cereal. So I left out a couple bowls um, from one of the cereals so we can eat that up and then we'll have that for today. It'll be easy, so I left out the strainer and everything. So we will um, be making that today, they will. And then I've got cookies to make, so I left the peanut for that. And I, um, just left out plastic, forks and spoons, and paper plates. The rest we're gonna get rid of. So I've got a big pile of trash over by the door, and um, they have a dumpster that I'll have the girls, they can walk over there and dump that for us today. And then everything else is like here and over there. So it's good, it's like a good morning. I'm like, that didn't take long at all. Just have to clean up the bathroom, but that'll be, you know, after everybody's up and moving, and the girls can do their room, the boys can do their room, it won't. It's not gonna take that long to do that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna edit right now, because I'm gonna edit today's video to get most of it done, because I think the afternoon I would like to have free time and be able to take the kids to the pool, to the game room, and then we can kind of chill. I have to get a grocery list, I gotta remember that get a grocery list as well and then um good day it's like i i left out window cleaner i want to clean the, the windows and the door for outside but that can be like a kid job um like later or, or i can do it doesn't matter and there's no dishes the dishwasher's empty so 
It'll be so easy. <laughs> it's so easy of a day. So I'm gonna edit for a little bit and then I'll see you in a minute. All right, I made it to the car with Jaden. Jaden, we decided, look, she did my hair. Look at, she's amazing. Jaden is so amazing. I am stretching for a different hairstyle. <laughs> I am the same. Yeah, you do. Pull it up in a bun, same. maybe a ponytail, or leave it down, curl it in. That's about it. Is anything different stretching? So she's like, Mom, she's been asking me to braid my hair. And I'm like, No, my hair's already done for the day. <laughs> so today she's like, Can I braid your hair? And I'm like, sh sh Sure, Jaden. And she like got me as I was sitting there editing, so I had no option. <laughs> and she did it. I was like, Jane, there's like flyaways. I'm like, can you just like pull this back? <laughs> so yeah, she was like, can you basically slick back your my entire hair with um what is it, the gel? So she's amazing. Sure. Look at what she did. Show what you did. Show the back. Oh, it looks, okay. Look at how awesome this is. Let's see. Like she is so good with hair. I don't think it shows. Oh, does it? Okay. Like you can see it, but it's very dark. Okay. There you go. Jaden is skilled. She is the hair skill person. I am not skilled. Grandma Linda, I think you've got skills there, not me at all. I've got zero zilch none. So Anyways, it's good. So we're okay. So contemplating what to do today because it's our, like our kind of our last day here. Kind of, not really, just in the apartment. So like the kids are sleeping in. They're tired. You know, everybody's exhausted. So I was like, I have to go to Walmart and get like minor things, like literally like ramen and like I mean it'll be minor. It'll be a whole cart full by the time we're done. But <laughs> small snacky stuff just to get us through the next get us through the next couple days happily. So I was like, do I, I was gonna go tonight with Greg and then I'm like, he's gonna get home. Why don't we just sit by the pool and relax? I want to go swimming today. Mm -hmm. And I got to upload. So I thought, well, if I go shopping right now, get it done, come back, get my editing done, and then that way I can upload while we're sitting in the game room because it takes 15 minutes and then be done because then my internet doesn't come to our new house till the next week. So I won't have to worry about coming back, blah, blah, blah. No yeah. big deals to anybody else but myself. So that's my thought process today. So we're going to run. We're going to run to Walmart. Jane says she's going to take me there. I'm not even going to do GPS. I'm like, I can do this, right? I can do this. New place, new thing. Greg's like, yeah, just turn up, you know, I-80, go to 209, and all these numbers, and I'm like, what? I don't even, <laughs> I'm just not direction. Jane's like, mom, I already got it. So I'm like, yeah. okay, so I won't even <laughs> GPS it. I'm just gonna follow Jaden. We're gonna do good. Yeah. Ready to go to Walmart? Yeah. Okay, we're going to Walmart, do our grocery haul for the moving day. It's gonna be delicious, healthy food. No, I'm just kidding. It's, totally. It's not. So it's, delicious. It's healthy. not. It's so, it's, it's just gonna be yummy food. Mm -hmm. Easy is what we're looking for. So, okay, let's go to Walmart. Okay, we made it. Yay. This like literally took us 10 minutes. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, was do you know where to go, Jane? I'm like, okay, I know where Costco is. I'm seeing things, but we made it. We're gonna go in and go get the little tiny bit stuff that we need. <laughs> let's go in. Okay, right away, Jaden grabbed the Loft House cookies. She was make everybody happy, so. Happiness cookies. All right, we have some throat stuff. Okay, we need trash cans. So I told Jane, do we carry trash cans around the entire store or get them last? We need a 32 right here. We need two of these right here. I have those, but we need these. Jane refuses to roll the shop thing through the whole store. It's so loud. <laughs> so loud. All right, Jaden. I guess we will just uh, have to wait. I do need Gorilla Glue. Okay, we need some Gorilla Glue. The Walmart is all messed up. Okay, we'll just get a small little one for, we do beef spring vegetable and apple flavors or bacon? I feel like bacon and steak. I'm just gonna get a small bag for today because that's just good. Okay, I'm gonna get some propel, what do they have? Ooh, they have watermelon. This is some good stuff right here. Oh, zero sugar, what's the difference? They're both zero sugar. Oh, this is Gatorade electrolytes. So more salt in it? More salt, I guess? Okay, we'll go. We'll do this one. Okay, we're gonna do some snacks here. White cheddar. The white cheddar, five dollars. Let's do one of those. Should we do? I'll do a party size bag. I got the party size bag down there. Do those. This is yummy. Let's get some Cheetos. Our twenty-five dollars worth of chips. Sam's Club is probably way cheaper. Or in Costco. Get some water here. Some of these for the house. This is good. We're debating between two and the six. I know I have some packed. But I'm thinking uh, we're definitely going to need James. She's going to make the cart work. Look at She's refusing to use the, get this out. So okay, we do need a broom. So I'm going to buy a broom here. We don't own one, which is crazy. So I'm going to get a broom. Broom. We, we haven't even had a broom. Buy a broom. We're like, I'm never buying another broom. Never buying another broom again. And here I'm buying one. We just need some yucky microfiber so we can just clean and throw them away basically if we need to. So we can go do that. Okay. Totally forgot soda. Let's just get a few. You want to get a couple? What? Let's just get a couple. Let's do. Do the minis. Do Dr. Pepper right there. Oh, Dr. Pepper and cream soda. Let's just do these. The 12 pack would be easy. You want to get a squirt? Look at there's burners, but burners zero shit. 
We're, Jane's gonna make this fake watch. I will absolutely carry it if necessary. Oh, she's but gonna have to eventually. We're gonna play Tetris instead. Why don't we put it on the bottom, put the can on top at least? It's okay, go ahead. Okay. It's gonna be fun watching Jane make, make it work. I like it. Making this work. She is her daddy's shopping cart girl. Look at this. She has nothing else to do but kind of organize her mom's cart. All right, let's go. Some Capri Sun for the kids. Okay, I am gonna get more paper plates because I do know we will run out eventually. So I better just be safe and get some, just because. I have a lot, but just to be I know. We got two juice boxes. Okay, look at Jaden, she's making it work. All right, toilet paper. I don't even have to worry about the, I always buy the Scott brand, but now I don't even need to. But I feel like, no way, Jaden. Right here, thousand sheets per roll for your kids. But I don't need a big giant. I just literally need a four pack. We have we have a tons packed away. Hold on. There we go. Ultra strong bath tissue. Okay, we're gonna get this one. Surely it's cheaper. There's no price, but it's got to be cheaper than that. We have like 50 rolls packed away, but we're on to our we're on to our last roll at the apartment, so we'll just be safe. Where do you want me to put it, Jaden? It'll be fun to like shop and look and like find what this Walmart has later. That, there you go. Apple Seuss 12. For six dollars, why don't you just get two of them? I know it's like twelve dollars worth of applesauce. Nope, up on top, cheaper. Oh, you mean the unsweetened one? That or has get no cinnamon. Sugar in it? Get cinnamon. No, they're all unsweetened. That one's unsweetened too. No sugar. Okay, we're gonna do this. Jane's getting cinnamon. Okay. Determined not to carry these shop these uh, things it's right here. Fun now. I think it's pretty good. Should we get some popcorn? Some of these, just to be safe. Look at that. They do have them. I just stacked up in the mountains because I didn't know if they had it. Well, that's good. Okay, we need to find ramen. Okay, ramen cups. Get two of those. Winner, winner. We're gonna do some of this. Kids wanted some bagels, so we're gonna do one cream cheese. Yeah, we'll just do enough for like temporary. All right, winner for the kids. They want some bologna. Okay, Jade made an entire store, not having to take that out of there. She did it. She's like, boom! Look at all that. Look at that Tetris, like her dad. <laughs> you did it. Two breads. Boom. Kind of like stocking up. Look at that. There's it. Look what they have a chalupa. Oh my goodness. These are the greatest things ever. Taco Bell used to sell these around your taco and they were fluffy. <gasps> Chalupas. Delicious. Jane's like, what? Look at this everything bagel flour top. Look at that. How yummy that would be for breakfast. Ooh, look at the sweet Hawaiian. Sweet Hawaiian. That's a vibe. Well, we're gonna have to come back and investigate. Jane's like, I was like, Jane's like, make everybody happy. Sure, Jaden. <laughs> These, it's so bad. I feel it's like so birthday bad. cake should be that. My mom used to always get. We'd always, she would always get like the white, like the whatever the Christmas ones were. They didn't even have them. Zebra yeah, like they'd be like, something like that. That's funny. Twinkies. They're so good. One day we'll get the Christmas ones in honor of Grandma. She will love it. Christmas tree cakes. I'm gonna buy you guys Christmas tree cakes like Grandma would buy Do at Christmas if they have them. She even just found. See all these things? They got avocado lime ranch. Did you just see that now? Oh no. Um, I was. She saw the other store. It was like 11:30, 10. I think it's 10:30. Oh, when you guys were here. And then Brooklyn pointed it out. I was like, oh, that's a. Here's the. What's the date? What's the date today? Um. 17th. What's oh, there isn't. No, we can do one of these. We do have Thomas. It's like the detox of the energy drinks. I said, Jane, let's go get some donuts. She's like, Yes, of course. Look at the bananas. These are from Costa Rica. Jane got some of these. Got some kombucha. I don't really know where they're at in North Carolina. Right here. I promise we're going to detox from life. Just not right now. Totally. I'll pretty soon I'll be making my own See, donuts. That's what the kombucha's for. The kombucha's for that. <laughs> we're going to do that. Do we need to, um, Okay, we got these for you know breakfast tomorrow because winter. Yes. And then I was like, wait a minute, we have all these cakes and we have lots of those cookies down here, so I think we're it's good. Okay, we're not really looking at what's in the cart; it's we're just more what's going into. <laughs> okay. Didn't Dad and I just come shopping three days ago, and I was like, oh, that's all I need for a week. All right. Okay, I think we are good. Look at little bite-sized brownies. Oh, look at you can look at the look at the crab cookies. It's an art thing. Look at how cute. Kids, summer at the That's sea. A vibe. You bet you can only get that in Florida. Okay, we are a Puerto Rican bread. What? I can't wait to try stuff. Okay. Oh, here's different colors. Should we get blue or just keep the white? We already got the white. Okay, I think we're done, right? Let's, I, I, think we're, I think I think I'm good. <laughs> Let's go. I gotta go home. Let's go home. Okay, did it. Yay, Jane. Yay. It was good. We did good. I was like, okay, I definitely spent a lot more, but it's okay. These will be drinks and stuff. We'll have extras. This will definitely, all of it, even the food we bought last week, Greg and I, we're still going to eat it this week. No food goes to waste. Yeah. No, I, it really doesn't. I literally, I think I threw away some rice because we were sick of rice, but it was literally like, 
two cups of rice. So really, like the food's not going away, so it's, it's a good thing. So the only bad thing is, I'm like, we gotta take this all upstairs. That's the only bad, the third floor, the little apartment view we got is really nice, and it, like the premiere was the first one yeah. available and the best one of the hotel, or not, of the apartment place. But you gotta carry up three things of elevators. <laughs> so, yeah. do we take it all inside the door? And then, like, let's take it all inside, sit there, and then load that elevator? Mm. That'd probably be easier than have the kids down, down the hallway. Let's do that. Versus taking it up, coming back out. I say just grab all the kids. There's a ton of us. <laughs> okay. A ton of us. Okay, we'll do that. Okay, so we're gonna go head back now and then we'll do a grocery haul, probably. Yeah, we'll do a grocery haul. I'll leave some stuff in the car like trash cans and the broom and doggy food. The ro doggy food and ramen cups because those we're gonna literally load this back in tomorrow. So, but we won't need to eat those before then. So, okay, let's go head back. Do you send your kids down to bring all the bags up? Then we're just left with a few mm -hmm. to take up. Okay, here's our next grocery haul. We just went a few days ago. This is just the, I don't even know, just throw stuff in there for the kids to be happy haul. <laughs> so we got down in the car is um, the trash cans and water and ramen and dog food. So I just left that down there because that won't melt. Got some Propel. I got mostly, well not mostly, I got a lot of stuff. Drinks, so I'll put some of these in the refrigerator. Got Squirt, Dr. Pepper, and there's a Coke over there. Got some bananas to eat. Applesauce, because the kids do like this here. Yeah, this is what we got. We got pop tarts. Again, don't judge. It's just this is what we're doing right now. We got some chips. We got kettle, party size, and munchies. We got this and some of these just over here. There's more over there. Toilet paper because we are out. This was on my list to buy because I broke my shelf taking it apart and I knew I had to get Gorilla Glue, so I got some here. Somebody had a throat not feeling great, so I got some of those. Kombucha. Got some healthy. Got two bagels and um, French onion dip because we have chips. Burrata dip. Cliff bars, they want a baloney because the kids do like baloney. This because they ask. Got this because I did Cheez Its. Here's the soda. We got Red Bull. I know, no judgment, just for right now. Pretzel chips. You know what I totally forgot to get? Hummus. Totally forgot to buy hummus. So, sun chips. I got these for cleaning because I want to be able to wipe the walls and everything down and not worry about like reusing my Norex cloth. So, these ones we can just throw away and we'll use them for the car too. I've got just some of this to use here with a paper towel, which is in the car. Donuts because today and tomorrow I'm okay with that. And these because I know I don't know if I have this I don't know if I have a scrub daddy or not. I could, I just don't know. So I got some they'll work juice boxes. Kids like them. This is for their bagels all the way over there. Bread for sandwiches. These because they love them. Plates because we probably need some more and paper towels. So this is good. Basically, I'm gonna put just the cold stuff in the refrigerator, like the um the sodas to get cold for tomorrow. The rest are going in a bag because we're gonna be actually taking it back down to the car tomorrow when we move in the house, so this is good. So what I am gonna do is I am gonna close today's video because I wanted to get this done. We're gonna put this away. The kids are gonna pack up their stuff today, finish getting everything ready, and then um, we're gonna have one more little laundry it looks like, and then we are gonna go, I'm gonna go upload, which takes 15 minutes. Kids are gonna suck up some Wi-Fi, and then we're gonna go to the pool today. That's gonna be the rest of our day here at the apartment because tomorrow we're moving in. So thank you for watching the journey and being along with us. Um, you have a fantastic rest of your day. We're gonna see you tomorrow. We're going to the house tomorrow. Super, super excited. So come back tomorrow. All right, bye.